many of those characteristics, but they are quiet. They're very quiet, and they want to be out in nature by themselves. They want to go for that walk by themselves. They want to surf by themselves. They want to um, notice all the physical world, to be so present to the world. I know Green said to me recently, I was talking to, to a man from Canada, and he said, he said, I don't wear, um, I don't wear headsets when I run because it, it's too distracting. There's so much to look at in the environment, you know, that it's distracting if I wear a headset because he's, he's taking in every bit of, you know, the, the leaf coloration and the changes in the roads and all that. I mean, he, these different types of seeing things, it's, it's like a different lens to look through the world. So greens are just seeing these details in nature that I can just tell you, I'm not, you know, I'm just, not seeing that, you know, I see other things. Really want convenience. Silvers do too. Um, but since, let's just say satins, it's got to be fun. So you know, you know, you can just kind of drop the gym guilt if you're a saffron because it's probably not going to work for you except for special reasons. If, I mean, if there's a special purpose to go to a gym if you're training for something and you, which has meaning to you, right. you know, but so you know you would you would um, be able to you I, in my book I have tips I have there's a chapter for every color and there are tips for every color activities and tips and approaches and motivation but you can you know you right away you can say okay I like this I'm not gonna like this I'm just gonna give up that because that's not gonna be me but you know you like convenience so you know what can you do out the door you might um, that's going to be a really important thing for saffrons um, to be able to do, to do something out the door and for silvers too. Um, blue, um, so you, you'd be able to um, you know, keep your gear handy. Reds, any of the, the saffrons, the silvers, the greens and the reds really need to keep their gear handy. They want to reduce the process. They want to, want to reduce the steps. Um, one of the things I will say to silvers and saffrons if they do go to a gym, don't go into a locker room because every time you introduce a step, yeah. you are at a decision point and you have to leave the locker room. So, um, you know, go to the gym ready to, you know, just ready to, to be, if you're going to go to gym, just go ready to be active and then go home, do you know, and go take your shower right. or whatever. But it's like, you know, so that would be advice that I would give, you know, saffrons and, and, uh, and silvers. Um, website and contact you if they want to know how to go further oh, sure. with their yeah. own um, mm -hmm. routine. Right, and I work with trainers too, yeah. Great. Yeah. Trainers love this because it's like you know, some cut to the chase of who they're working with. Yes. You know, if they're working with a blue or gold, they better assure them safety because you don't know, but blues and golds can feel like they're getting injured by working out. And that's something that if a trainer can really say, really assure their interest and say, you know, we're going to really work step by step. I really know that you're concerned. Are you, in the, are you concerned about injury? Yes. Well, I really know that. So I'm going to make sure that you're safe. And while you're here, I'm going to be teaching you how to work out in a very safe way. Wouldn't even occur to them if they didn't know. Are a certain type of people that gravitate towards a specific type of exercise. Is that something that's delineated in the the colors um, as well? That's or a, just how you approach it? It's all really fitness. how you approach because mm -hmm. there are people that like yoga is a really good example. I I, um, I interviewed somebody that um, who's blue and she really likes yoga and I asked her to tell me about her yoga experience and she said. Well, I do it on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So she's already got it mm -hmm. down, Today. organized by the day. So that's one thing that she really likes. She's concerned about correct form, and yoga really does teach form. She's not at all interested in the spirituality of it. Um, she's probably not too interested in the breathing of it, but she has found what she likes about yoga is that it's, it's methodical. methodical. It's very methodical. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, exactly. That's, yeah, it is. It's very methodical. Isn't that um, interesting? Yeah. So she might go to a specific type of class that teaches a certain way, 
Yeah. And that is, I think, why there are so many different types right, of right. yoga. Right. Because something might not appeal to her in, let's say, you know, um, a vinyasa flow. Right. Where the teacher changes it up and he just right. wants you to move right. and he changes and she doesn't have that same class right. every She's time. Can like, your colors change over time? Great question. And if they can if they do change, then how often should you check to see if the colors have changed? Does it mean a life transformation, or do you change with age? Can you tell yeah. us about that? Yeah. Uh, yes, I can. I can, and, and this brings us really to um, the basis of of um, the theoretical model that I've used in um, in the Eight Colors is the Myers Briggs of uh, personality inventory of uh, Jungian personality type. Your, the theory um, in this is that your color doesn't change, your fitness personality doesn't change, your type doesn't change, the expression of it changes over time. So even though like, I am naturally a purple harmony, now I might, I am um, probably at this point in my life more introverted, I am because I'm naturally extroverted, I'm now more introverted as I've gotten older. I can spend more time by myself to probably exercise closer to a white harmony. Um, so, if that makes sense, sure you know, that, that who, mm -hmm. so it's, you know, your expression, you, your, your personality doesn't change, but the expression of it changes. Because we are really kind of driven to wholeness, to developing our other side, and to enjoying our other side. You know, for me personally, understanding my fitness personality has been um, really interesting for me because I, kind of watch myself in different situations and um, realize too that what I like and that it's, I, I like activities that are uh, repetitive, that I can zone out in. I like to do, like to bike or swim or run. Things that I don't, I don't like any choreography. So when I go and I, you know, people say, oh, that's, you know, God, you got to come to the Zumba class, and I'm, 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 I, I am, you know, and now I can comfortably say no because that choreography is like very distracting for me, and it's and mm -hmm. and it's actually stressful to do that. Where somebody else, um, that's just what they want. They want to have fun. They want flow. They want music. They want to be distracted by you know all of those elements. For me, I'm looking for something calm and quiet and by myself. Jungian personality types is popularized by Myers Briggs. So there's a, there's a whole system here that I I did an application to fitness, but so I did you know I did the research in the application of fitness. It has been used in you know in careers. It's been used in relationships. It's been used in education and counseling, but it hadn't been used in fitness. So I did the the fitness application. But you're incredible. You're yes. just amazing. Everything's well. I, I tell you, I one, once I saw it, I just. Once I saw that there that there was this relationship, I just couldn't stop. And uh, you know, it's really been a very exciting part of my life to be able to. It's to exciting do for me to know, yeah. and I'm sure yeah. a lot of other people. And um, yeah. the best is yet to come. I, I hope so. I really hope this gets out because I'm so committed to people living a, a physically active life. I think that we um, are too. We are. Mm -hmm. um, we there's just no. It, it's just got to be for people just need to have access to that part of themselves and for their well-being and uh, there's so many pieces to it and this is my contribution. <laughs>